Also, warning, I'm pretty good at double dash, so... Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah. I'm expecting... I'm not gonna lie. Did you see my video with uh, Evangelia? I, I haven't, no. Okay, I'm so proud that she beat Rainbow Road on double... I say beat. She fell off about 25 times, but she, she completed a lap of Rainbow Road without getting frustrated, which, for her... Good. Yeah, for a three-year-old really on Rainbow Dash. Okay. I remember, I yeah. think I played Double Dash when I was like four or something. Oh, man. And like, I remember it was hard for me to hold down the A button. You're 20, I'm 28, I can do the math on that. <laughs> yeah, it was hard for me to like hold down the A button. Like, yeah. it was like too hard in motor tasks. Like, hey, I'll be right back. Alrighty. Free player. Alrighty. There's limited characters, so I kind of want to wait till Jay gets back to pick because I don't know what characters he wants to pick. Does it really matter? I mean, to me, it matters. The best characters oh, in the game are. Uh, wait, so like, what's the what's the double dash tier list? So the best characters are the like babies. That's what I thought. Yeah. That's well, how well, I they're, felt. well, they're uh, these characters. These are the best. These are the best characters. I always thought they were like the babies because I they... personally don't like the babies. I like uh, my favorites are um the toads and the koopas, and then heavies are work or the worst, right? Uh, I I don't know. I don't know enough about. I don't know enough to say if they're worse or better than the, the mid. Uh, so but there's the best cart. Basically, the best cart is um uh is the uh. What's it called? The train? I don't... What's the DK? I don't, I don't even remember what it's called. Oh, yeah, I should really remember that, but, um... What it means? So, you have to have both lightweights to get, uh... It is this. What else? Oh. How do you... Oh. So the cars have stats? Oh, I actually didn't know that. How do you see the stats? I don't think you can in this mode, but this car is 100% have stats. Um... And the best is that car. I don't use that though. I use um the second best car. Um, so I'm gonna barrel train. Sorry, I don't know how I wasn't thinking about that. I'm gonna play the one that Evangeline and I were playing for sentimentality. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna go with my my OG. Oh yeah. Light cars are kind of broken in this, right? Uh yeah. That's what he was. He just said that this was the best. That's the best car. Yeah. So we have. But downstairs. that's the hardest to handle, on my opinion. So. Downstairs we have Mario Kart Wii, uh -huh. where bikes were broken. Bikes were broken in that game. Yeah. yeah. Alrighty. What do we want to do? Oh, does player one have to do it? Yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, oh no, sorry. we're not doing this one first. <laughs> we got to save that for last. Okay. Oh man! Yeah, she's okay. Okay. Oh, this, this is all right. Awesome. Yeah. This one's sort of too good to do first. It's uh, good, but... you want to wait? No, no, I'm fine. Yeah, it's starting off with dessert, right? Oh, and it's Zia. No, Zia switch seats, right? Yeah. yeah. And also, like, I'm, I'm like right? still not that good at this game. Like, there's people who are oh, god. Yeah. yeah. Um. Like, I'm mean, way better. I don't use a lot of stuff. There's something called Apex, where I, like, use sometimes, but not really. I don't really know what I'm doing, honestly. Ooh, hello. Like, I think I'm hot for boosting once in a while, like, doing the drift boost. Yeah. And you're over there just, you know, making it look super oh. easy. How am I still in second? <laughs> that is... Uh, uh, I'm in third. Uh. There we are. Oh. This is gonna be a separate recording when we actually do it. Like I can't. Some people that snake, they can just drift back and forth. Well, oh, I mean, I think that I, I think that. I, like I've heard someone be obnoxious and tell me it's technically not snaking in this game. Uh, it's just like chain many turbos. I'm like, come on. As an F Zero GX player, it's not, but whatever. It basically is. I just like, but they call it snaking in other other games, like in uh in in uh the DS version, they 100 percent call it snaking. So like, why would it? Uh, yeah, why wouldn't you call it that in this game? Doesn't go weird. 
Oh. Did he? Let me run into the fence a couple times before I die. Alright, well, I fell off twice, so I'm. <laughs> Ooh, hello. Oh, that's what that does! Oh, what does? Oh, Peach's heart. Oh, yeah. It's actually, like, a pretty good item. So, that, I was wondering why I wasn't getting hit with the red shell that hit came by. I guess that can do it. Okay. I am so far behind now. I, uh, I, I fell in the water twice. Yeah, yeah. As, as, as well as I'm doing, by well, I mean, eh, yeah. you better be. Woo! I love that song. Yeah. That's the part where you go. You know, you know yeah. the quote unquote shortcut on the stage? So if you have a boost, you can do the, the jump near the beginning? Like the tunnel, though? I. Apparently not. Oh, man, it's so cool. This is the, one of the coolest things about the stage as a kid, it's so cool. Hey, you wait, wait. Don't, don't finish. Me. Yeah, okay. finish for just a second. Oh, never mind. It's so sad. Okay. Uh, now I'm, I'm gonna stop. What's up? No, 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 no. It, it's good. I, he was just right. near it, but the chain chomp. Oh, I got gotcha. you. But yeah, there's a there's a shortcut. It's not actually shorter, but it's really cool. <laughs> <laughs> If you want to yes, see it, yeah, it's, yeah. it's worth seeing. Like, it's one of the coolest things in Bubble Bash. I'm watching your screen, man. Well, someone needs to get a- you need a mushroom to do it, so... Okay. I'll just stay behind, and I'll get some mushrooms. Yeah, Alright, I got mushrooms. Hey! Okay. Okay. Alright, okay, so here's the shortcut. Alright, All right, I'm set. watching you. Oh, wait, wait. I'm watching. Oh, oh no, set. I didn't know about that! <laughs> I can't, yeah. Dude, that reminds me of some, like, if you play Diddy Kong Racing, the uh, the keys you had to get in some of the stages. There's one that's hidden in a similar spot. Oh, man, they don't like me, I'm sorry. Uh, alright, alright, we're right. going for it again. Oh, right. I got a blue shell, just a second. Lightning to death combo. Huh. Okay, I got it. I got it. Alright. Okay. You see it? Yeah. Wait. Wait, there we go. It's not actually right. faster, but that's cool. It's still really cool. Competitively, is it at all viable? No, no, it's it's, it's slower, so okay. <laughs> There's a lot of quote unquote shortcuts like that in Mario Kart. Uh, in this game specifically, that like, they're just straight up slow. Also, you can dodge blue shells. Yeah, I didn't. Mean, it's just so hard, I can't do it. I knew that it was possible. It's a two frame window. Okay. So you're not talking about like with a boost, you mean you can actually just dodge? Yeah. Hey! Oh, hello. Why not? I have it, I might as well. I'm sorry. Hello. You got a ways to go, bro. Like, I am fox tech skilling my thumb right now with the callus that I have on it by trying to do that. Yeah, it's actually like not that bad motion, but like it's hard to like it's kinda hard to face one, but you gotta like barely move or you'll have to go back and forth like so much. Because like you don't actually have to you have to basically like get out of the neutral zone. Like Okay. So if you know like a the dead zone, zone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's fair. When you put it that way, that makes a lot more sand and dirt. Hello. I really like this game. This is it's it's charming. this is basically just a nostalgia trip, you know. Uh, now you also play some sunshine. I do. I actually two nights ago I. Ah! Wait a minute, I everything! Okay, uh, two nights ago, um, for the first time I just, like, sat down and played, like, a game. My time was three hours and 46 minutes. 
playing it without the intended speedrunning? No, I was trying to speedrun it. So, I, I just never yeah. done it before. Dang. Um, so, like, I lost so much time on oh, some wow. places. Like, uh, oh, I would DK Mountain? Yeah. yeah. This is also one of my favorite courses. Talk so, like, also there's a shortcut here. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Okay, now this actually. one, yeah. Oh, you do? Yeah. If, the, if you're talking about the one I think you're talking about. Oh, okay. Um, I think this was at the edge of Nintendo Power. And I think that's why I remember seeing something about that. Nintendo Power didn't make it much longer. Oh, I got so lucky. Ooh. I don't think I should like, die. There's some tech where you land faster. Yeah. You hold the button. I don't remember which button mode it is. I know. I'll tell. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's great. Uh, I see what you did there. Oh, <laughs> that was pretty fun. I got the shortcut. I do not. Oh, oh. I'm gonna throw myself in the crater here. Ooh. I'm gonna throw myself off the bridge. This game came with my game too. Oh, oh really? Yeah, I got the platinum one. Oh, nice! Oh, that's so cool. Cool. Yeah. This game. So, that's yeah. so cool. This is one of the games that has that compatibility. You can uh, play on land with it. It's not playing over the internet or anything, but. Something. Yeah, up to eight. Yeah, up to eight players. Oh man, I knew that. If you like, you can get momentum going backwards while you reverse. Uh, one really cool thing in this game, in multiplayer, in my opinion, is that like, if you're really like so good, that you can time your, your blue shell to hit like over a gap. Yeah. I've done that once, I felt so cool. Like, <laughs> yeah. when you said blue shell hit over a gap, you mean hit your opponent or just try to hit Yeah, yeah, so I'm like, send the blue shell at just a specific time so that while they're making the jump, it hits them. Oh, I gotcha. I meant to cancel the attack, it makes it where they, they always fall in. Yeah, they fall into the pit. I've only done that one time, though. So. But now I've only tried it one time, so... I... Fair enough. You may get a chance to just the moment. Yeah. So Beck Abney, the Mario six, the Kart 64 speedrunner, showed me the world of uh, Double Dash racing. Yeah. Let's see if I can not suck here for just a moment. Hey! Now that you're in first, and by first I mean I raise it for fun. I'm gonna have to watch this afterwards. Oh, hello. See what all you're doing to get that much further ahead. Yeah, I'm hey. actually not, like not. I'm I'm playing pretty pretty. Yeah. Not even sure what you're doing. Yeah, I I've been racing with the barrel card or whatever, so I think that's like confusing me a little bit. Just gonna see stuff. Yeah. So in this game, yeah. remind me, what is Boo's weight category? Because you think he's heavy. He's heavy. Yeah. You would think as a ghost. But, yeah. Yeah. I have no idea why that's the case, but is he heavy in the other Mario Kart? Uh, to be honest, I haven't played deeply into any after Wii, so okay. I couldn't I couldn't say. He was I like ready. I like oh, you it. hate this one? No, I said I like it. Oh, you I like, like it? Okay. Like Let's go for it. It's it gives me nightmares from Mario Kart 64, the one with traffic, Toad Highway, I think. Oh yeah. Oh, well, what do you think about the Wii version? Uh, uh, like Toad Highway? Or like a like Moonlight, whatever, I don't know. Is it Toad Highway? Zero out of ten, you can't glitch the way. I'm kidding. I like that stick. I mean, the uh, Wii version, whatever. Uh, let me try to like, really get some tricks in here. Also, do people know like... Oh, you like a best route. I... It's been so long, even if I did at one point, I do not now. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, that... Nailed it. You can do that with uh... Oh, got hit by a car! I will 
take that as he come on and slam. Come on, get up. There we go. Uh -oh. Lo siento, señor. Qué lástima. What a shame for this video. I was so bad. I wish that I had learned it back in the day. Unfortunately, I did not. I thought that French would be a fine alternative. But, uh, I would have enjoyed it. Oh, okay. Aww. You know, that might actually have a really good advantage. advantage. Learning the, uh, the other one that might be super hard. Yeah, we're out. Out. Mow on the truck. Oh, Chain Chomp can do that. Now, can we bring Was that Bruno? That was Bruno. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a nomination when we actually start choosing, but uh, right now, Daisy Cruz, okay. sound good? Alright, let's do it. Yeah, this is the one you've actually had to play on camera. Did you know it's actually faster to go around the pool, like, the other side? I can't do it. I just, it looks like it's shorter, but... Oh, hello! Oh, I'm going to Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh no! Oh no! I forgot there was a tub there. Yeah. There's a gap. Oh. Find the gap, T1. Oh no! I'm trying! The choice of Mario Kart. You are clearly the more skilled player, and uh, and I'm in first. Uh, that happens. Ooh. So it seems like the red shells have a certain amount of time before they lock in, lock on. Um, Ooh, there's a, I don't know, so... The table move! Ah, crap. I'm sorry, you were so, saying? It's sort of like, if you're really close to a opponent, sometimes say you just miss. Oh, wow. You are way ahead of me. a lot of Mario Kart prior to the big tournament last year. Why? I don't know. Ah. It's not a Mewtwo King thing. There's not an actual reason. It's just because they go. Uh. Yeah, Mango is so good. Oh, no. It gets in your head, man. Yeah, he is such a good player. I've never played him. But I'm watching his stream, I'm like, this guy is so good. I mean, I'm gonna sound a little controversial, but I'll explain it. Uh -huh. He's actually not technical at all. Of the gods, uh -huh. he's one of the least technical. No, he's not, he is the least technical. Yeah. I don't think that's true. Of Maybe like PPMD, because PPMD admits to not Which being able to show drop. Which god would you say? I can't even really talk about PPMD. The last time he played oh, yeah, it was, yeah, I mean, yeah, okay. Shield Drop he wasn't a thing. Hungry Box wasn't and Shield Drops. But yeah, then he doesn't but, play. But like, that wasn't a thing top. when PPMD played. Right, the last yeah. time he played that wasn't... I mean, some people were doing it, but it wasn't like... Like... What it is you know, now. do you know Dash Dance Dan? 
Dash Sanchez. It sounds familiar, but I, I he's a he's sense. a Georgia player. He was like one of the first people who did shield dropping. Okay. So like he was shield dropping like 2010. Like if I am really intentional, I can roll or dash, and then shield the eye full one direction, uh-huh. and then I can notch down. Yeah, I can't. Like, I mean, I can't shield drop. I can, but like I don't do it in game. I can't it's make myself do it in tournament. Yeah, so. That's basically the same thing as not being like I, I should! I played Jigglypuff and Fox! I really uh, need to! Yeah, I mean, Shield Trap Shine is like a broken option, yeah. so. No kidding. Even just like Shield Drop back air. Yeah. But uh, just to get them in a net, disadvantageous place. I mean, I would say, uh, of the gods, Mewtwo King, PKMD, Armada, H Fox, Mango. I would say Mango is the second most te- technical after Armada. Most so, technical? Well, yeah. In terms of using tech skill? I mean, yeah. he's yeah, the guy that said, I'll quit the game if I have to learn shield. No, I yeah, but, I mean, learn learn shield shield but he, he did, did learn. But he did. I mean, like, you watch his movement. It's like immaculate. It's like perfect. And every, all his movement is like. Okay, it's so good. It's like sense. his precision as his characters is. He's like, like the soccer yeah, but, player that can dribble the ball really quickly and uh-huh. really fin- with the finesse, but he can't kip it over his head or anything. He he can't do but that. But I sort mean, of stuff. he doesn't do like dumb technical stuff. Yeah. But like none of the gods do. It, He's so. not a hex. Yeah. 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 I mean, the only god. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, why? Who? Like, which god would you say is, is more technical than him? But like multi shining is like you, do you consider left hand no. no, so I would definitely so say left hand is more technical. Yeah. Also, yeah. also Armada. Yeah, that's the person. Yeah. I'm and now, now this is when he was playing. I would say at the time, PP was more technical than I don't think so. Too. Maybe when he was playing Fox and Mewtwo K, when that was his only character. But he's been mean? doing Sheik and Marth for so long that he's Who? his Fox has got Mewtwo K. I mean, Mewtwo King's tech skill is like. Bizarrely immaculate, yeah. you know, Mewtwo but King, like, yeah. it's still, I still think Mango is like, better. If Mewtwo King could find a way to practice 30 hours a day, he would. <laughs> He's that guy. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> what, uh, what stages do we want to play? Are you ready to go, or? I can play some more. Okay. Oh, okay. Do Mushroom Bridge. Um, yeah, but like, I, he's definitely more technical than HBox, like 100%. Um, I would say he's more technical than PP just like on a head to head, like Mango can do stuff PP can't. So, or yeah. well, Mango could do stuff PP could, and could like we yeah. don't really know. Anymore. So, the thing about Mango that gets me is that when I say he gets in your head, mm-hmm. it's almost like there's a spectrum for the players at the very, very top where the more they get in your head, the less, less tech skill, and vice versa. Mm-hmm. Where Mewtwo King well, and Mecha some... played by the book, and Mango and Hungrybox are playing you. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I, I sort of agree with that. I know what you mean, like, some of the hardest reads are the least technical, yeah. right? Yeah. It's like, yeah. And when, when you play against me, and you um, see me shielding, I, I'm i a low enough level player that you know what I'm going to do next. You know I'm going to buff or roll back. You know I'm going to try to jump or shield back Well, or you whatever. can just make a soft guess, yeah. and then like... He does that to the best players yeah. in the world. Yeah. And why he does is because his pressure is so much oh, better, yes. so he makes them... Oh yeah, he forces them out of their, he forces them into their instinct, I guess is the way I put it. So I remember, I remember on this stage, I would always try to like, ride over the uh, bridge, the rails of the bridge. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's slower, believe it or not. So it's, 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 it's there. There is. There is? Okay. Um, but you just have so much art going upwards. Um, that said, it is, it is uh, faster if you're a mini. If you get struck by lightning, it's faster. Uh, hmm. Does it boost your photo or something? Well, you cover more distance, you know, because like you take like the art versus the straight line, you know? Yeah. Okay. So this is a video game, so I don't want to take for granted the, the physics of yeah. the video game. Uh-huh. That's, a, that's such a good point. It's like in melee, you know, like you can cover the same amount of distance, like, uh, like jumping straight off as like jumping sideways. Like, yeah. 
That's like, yeah, I may have been. Are you familiar at all? I, I don't know why you would be with, um, um, what is it? So in the Super Mario 64 community, there is a, a group that tries to beat the entire game as best they can without pressing A. Oh yeah, that works. Yeah, I have to do with the community. So Super Mario 64 has a tacit that does what's called the ABC challenge, the yeah. button challenge, where they try to press the A button as few times as they can, and I am unfortunately not computer savvy enough to help them out with the technical <laughs> aspects of it. Uh -huh. But, fun fact, the, uh, there's a speedrunner for Super Mario 64 that plays on the Wii, and Discovery, while yeah. asleep, a, a new way to say yeah, an A-Press. That's crazy. The A-Press. Yeah. If you play on any percent, Tommy, there's only one time you have to press A normally, and it's when you are uh, Bowser, Bowser in the fire seat. Oh, Bowser, yeah. yeah. Right, right. And you have to get off the pole. There's a pole in there you have to mm -hmm. get off of. Well, on the Wii version, it's a virtual console that has an emulation error that actually rounds in such a way that those platforms that go under and over the lava rise over time and gets you high enough if you don't mind waiting a few days. Yeah, so it's like, <laughs> TAS is three days, but like, real time, like for a human, it's an eight day wait. Yeah. Mm. Um, yeah. Mm. Uh, I'm actually like, kind of surprised like, and then, you know, hasn't posted about that yet. Yeah. Because um, it's virtual console maybe? Yeah, I think he sort of resents that someone else found it. That's my read. Uh, maybe. I um, don't... I don't know, because he does so many Tyler Caney and, and uh, Bomberman, not Bomberman, somebody at Time Bomber. He does Time Stopper. He does those videos. Um, I don't know. Yeah, but, uh, what was I going to say? Um, I, okay, yeah, I have a great fun fact about... Can we uh, race while we do yeah, this? Yeah, I have, a, have to leave soon. I have a great fun fact about Panem. Okay. All right, it's very short, it's very to the point, but... It's probably surprising, so he's Borb's brother. I knew that! I yeah. saw that on Borb's trivia page! Oh, really? no, it's SSB Wiki. Okay, yeah, isn't that crazy? That's amazing. That's amazing, yeah. Uh. <laughs> Ooh. Um, yeah, but he's... Borp's brother. If you go back on Borp's channel, you can find videos with uh, him. Oh, who does he play? I have to know. No, 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 no. So not in melee. Oh, uh, okay. So that's how I, that's how I found out. Was like one of like two men. I'm like question mark. Like, are you serious? That's amazing. Yeah, it's not great. I did. It's a small world. I, someone commented on one of his. This is how I found out. Someone commented on one of his videos. I love how your brother doesn't use text skill and you do stuff like this. Uh huh. Well, um, yeah, what was I going to say about, uh, I have no idea, the ABC challenge, right? Yeah, about the ABC challenge, um, you were doing a lot of A-presses recently, mm -hmm. from, uh, from 100%. They found a new glitch in Ship and Sandland, where it's not, not, not really, so, they found a setup in the lobby. Okay, okay. Yeah, it's not literally a new glitch, but you know. Well, it's the new part is in the lobby, and then they had to figure out some setup yeah. to get them enough speed to run. Yeah, but and it technically didn't even save an A press, depending on which ver which version. If it's virtual console, it didn't save an A press because you could already do secret 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 because it's like yeah, a yeah, yeah. yeah, virtual consoles are for whatever reason more stable. Like, well, they have more um, RAM, I think. Is that what that is? Oh, maybe. Because, like, you know, they have access. Ooh! I could have at least I'm, I'm not sure about that. I am not, you know, no. I don't know. I mostly just watch that stuff casually because it's so cool. It is. It's so yeah. neat. Tell me, if you haven't gotten into this at some point, it's really cool. Do like, you remember that meme that took over the internet for a little while? It was the uh, Watch the Rolling Rocks and 0.5 A press. It was such a cool video. Like, I think it's so cool. Like, where, 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 where. Oh man, it's a. Uh, he, he gets to the star, Watch the Rolling Rocks, and Dizzy Base Day without having to press the A button, sort of. Um, I actually made a video on my channel, Magic the Gathering, instead of 
melee or party or anything like that. But it's where I win a game of magic and half the mana. And so I guess I'm I guess I'm on the lead too. Uh, like, are you just... I'm gonna watch this back and uh, and realize what you're doing, but... Are you just drifting literally the entire I'm time? I'm good amount. I'm still missing out, like a ton of drifts, but... That, that's... I'm trying, but I can't only straight away do it without feeling like I'm losing time. I don't... I don't know. <laughs> oh, this game is so sad because if you come, if you come last, it just takes away your control. Uh, it's like so humiliating. It's like I don't even get to complete the race. Seven, seven, seven. Literally every time we've done this. Oh wait, I've got it. Okay, so here's my nomination. Baby what? Park. Baby Park. Let's go. This is a <laughs> the shortest stage by a substantial yeah. margin, but seven laps. Yeah, seven laps. I actually. uh... I think um some stages if you're really fast are close to us time. By like 20 seconds to be fair, but fair enough. I am not. Oh, hello. I'm not doing holding on to a blue shell. Also another uh, another thing about dodging the blue shells is that the their RNG based on the speed they come in at you. So it's also just a guess. Oh. Um, on when and what speed they're going to use. Teach me about bar double dash frame data. So, well, I'm just, so I, I'm just like, I'm just, you know, parodying this. Like, I haven't practiced it yet. Like this. So, like, I cannot dodge a blue shell at all. Like, so That's I'm, not the, I'm not the one to tell you about it. It's all good. I am, like, I am on, like, I made a few posts on, like, the Mario, Mario Kart Double Dash 4. Like asking questions and stuff. Okay. Oh, I remember now why I was why I was thinking that the uh, the number of frames that you were mentioning for input lag is wrong because I remember watching a video by Akira. I think it's Akira. No, not Akira. Dan Silvato. Yeah. Silvato. Who he was talking about input lag yeah. and he was going over why the, you have two to three frames of input lag, but that must be something different. There yeah, might be like a, a subset of the input lag or something. I have no idea. Was he talking about faster melee or whatever? Uh, yeah, he was talking about faster melee. Yeah, I think I've seen that video. I don't remember. He was talking about controller pulling, is where he got he got that from. Huh. So I think that must just be a subset then. Yeah, there's a lot of weird stuff with controllers, like it checks your, you know, um, yeah. control stick position every twice a frame. Weird stuff like that. I don't really know a lot about it though. I'm gonna play one more. All right. No, okay. In that case, yeah, we know. Uh, uh, Tommy, do you? I've gotten mine. I've got my nominee. What's yours? Okay. I think I know what it should be yeah. personally. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. I think it should be Rainbow. Already covered. Yeah. Uh, it's because okay. it's the last one he's gonna do. Yeah. All right. Oh. Rip all of us except you. Actually, You're, you'll be okay. <laughs> I have a sneaking suspicion you'll be okay. Hey, this is as far ahead as I'm getting. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 the boost killed me. <laughs> I really love the game. Yeah. <laughs> it was the last traditional console Nintendo had. Someone, yeah, that's actually really so true. true. That's, yeah. Wow, I've never thought about that. That's actually crazy. The I think the Switch, switch, the switch is a little bit of a true. Wow. Okay, fair enough. Actually, I think you're right. It's portable, but that's not really... Yeah. Well, I don't know. I would, I would call it non-traditional. Because of like, like no, I, I don't own the Switch, I haven't played a Switch, so I can't... No, you played it? No. Oh, wow, well, that sucks. So Nintendo and I are not on great speaking terms <laughs> right now, and it's because of what happened with the fan name game called AM2R, and... Oh, is that a Metroid game? Yep, another, another Metroid 2 remake. They, uh, they shut it down, and they also shut down Pokemon Great. So, so yeah, I remember Pokemon. 
Yeah. Because of that, I've kind of not been crazy about Nintendo. So as, as I'm playing a Nintendo game. Were you like really into it? Uh, AM2R I was. I can't mm-hmm. say I was for Blue Rank. It was very after the fact in that case. But, you know, there's a development cycle of about 10 years for AM2R. Yeah. And I followed it for some of that. Oh god. I was so scared of that, uh, of the banana peel and the pulse clock getting me. Yeah, well that's... I mean, I wasn't into that, so I don't... Yeah. I, admittedly, some of it is perhaps sentimentality, but that game that I just showed you before this, Fantasy Star Online, that is a Sega, specifically Sonic Team game. And Sonic Team is so good about allowing their IP... There's a version of the game for PC called Blue Burst that you can play right now for free because mods of the game, they, don't, they won't shut you down. It's in their right to, but they don't. Because they do that as what they don't know. But, I mean, that's like, so often. Hmm. Like, I know people, Nintendo didn't shut down for you, but like... Yeah, it, it felt like, it. even though you're right, they didn't, it kind of felt like it. I, okay, this is the best explanation I've heard for why it shut down. I think this is probably just straight up right. Is you know, the people who are making PM, you know, they're up and coming game developers. Mm, yeah. So like they just don't wanna have like a cease and desist by Nintendo like on their name. Yeah, on their name, you know? Yeah. Like I think that was I think at the end of the day that's why they stopped developing. I think there's not like a decent chance PM is going to like get more development. Like straight up. If, I mean, some of the development that's happened since then, of course, it's been purely fan-made, like yeah. Ridley. Ridley! Dude, or Knuckles, well, okay, Knuckles was apparently a late development for uh, the actual dev team. But Knuckles, somebody for, um, okay, you can't jump this in season four. Oh my god. Yeah, I tried to DS. We can do that. Are yeah. you the DS version? No. Oh, that's so good. My newest portable Nintendo console is a color. Which, I mean... And, and we also had a, uh, a GameCube player, a Game Boy player for the game. Yeah. Oh! Come on. I know where you are. Oh. Might as well find out now whether I can throw this thing backwards. I can! I'm so good. Hey, it's all good, backwards. You can throw the egg backwards. I'm oh, his egg. It's been so long I can't speak to anything else here, but... I can speak to that one. Well, you can throw other items backwards too, but like, yeah. Neat. You know, like bananas. Yeah. yeah. Can you launch bananas forward in this game? Like yeah. 64? Yeah. Alright. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. If you're at your games, the games. Anytime you want to come over, man. It's good, nice right? meeting you. That's the hour two. Oh my god. That's good. Good yeah, yeah that's fun playing. Sorry, I'm. <laughs> these are like the two best video games I've been at, so. Alright. Yeah. So, while I'm at it. Oh, I was gonna show you the rest of my Nintendo list. Okay. Do you wanna. Pull, so, I'm down to play more Double Dash, or Melee, or. Uh, Sunshine. Alright. I'm gonna be the host guest to sing them all. Alright. come too if you'd like. It's good. Um, wait, are, do you have snacks? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. 